In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to bomb one of the best coverages in Madden 21, the Cover 3 Cloud. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. If you've never been to my YouTube channel before, what I do is I post four times a day here on YouTube. I post tactical tips and strategies that are designed to help you improve, help you teach you concepts, teach you things that you can do to get better at this game. And so if that's something that interests you, I want to ask you right now, go ahead and click that subscribe button. That way you never miss an upload. And also check that bell notification icon, click that as well. That way you can be notified because we live stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern. We actually got a live stream coming up here in about an hour and a half um, on our YouTube channel, so be able to check that out. You can click the link below uh, in the description to be able to get access to that, or just jump in the Discord. But anyway, let's jump into this. So, I don't know if you've faced this defense, but I certainly have. <laughs> and, uh, and, and it's been irritating me. First and foremost, I want to show you kind of the challenge that it presents for a, a spread formation like what I like to run. So if you run, let's say, I'll show you a, a defense or a, a route that I like to use last year to be able to beat a defense like this, okay? And the, the play was Y cross. And basically all I would do is take the left side guy, put him on a slant or put him on a little flat route. And then I would be able to throw this. This year, it's very, very tricky to do that. As you can see there, um, the cover three cloud does a good job because this guy's not in a deep half he is in an outside um he's in an outside third so you can't hot route that zone that's what makes that so good so um i'm gonna back that flat off and i think i got my flats on 25 yards or something like that but anyway if you take a look here you know i can't get this ball to him as you see there it's gonna be picked every time so it's just irritating Understand, and, and, and I hope you hope you hung with what I just said. He's in an outside third. You see a lot of people doing this from Big Nickel over G. Uh, this is basically a video on how to glitch outside thirds. Uh, how to, and not, you know, I wouldn't call it a glitch. I would call it, um, you know, basically a route combination that's designed to beat this. But anyway, so cover three cloud. We're going to go over this here. Um, but I face this uh, in weekend league, and this, this gave me a little bit of issues. And so I found this. I haven't talked a lot about the gun cluster this year, so I figured I'd talk about it. This is from Arizona's playbook. I wrote an entire guide on this. If you want to pick the guide up, you can pick it up in the description of this video. Um, a lot of people have been really enjoying the guide. Um, it's full offense, full defense. So full Arizona offense, full 4-6 defense, one-time fee, and you get the guide. So no, no subscriptions or anything like that. Now, the play we're going to be using is Mesh Post. So this little uh, streak route here um, to Schultz is going to basically act like a corner route. And all I'm going to do is streak Amari Cooper. And what you're going to see here, uh, this is the same coverage that was giving us issues. Watch the deep third on this play. The deep third is going to go with the motion route. And you can pass lead that streak to Amari Cooper for an absolute dot against the cover three, cl uh, cover three cloud. This is very significant to me um, because... I see a lot of this defense. Like, I see it against Big Nickel over G. I see it in 335. I see it in even Dollar, but I mainly see it in Big Nickel over G uh, and in Nickel 335. All you got to do is just put him on a streak, pass lead it to the left, and you're going to be roasting coverage over the top. Um, so, you know, it's not the, it's not quite the same as the, um, as the bunch. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So if I just go to Mesh out of this, and I'll just flip the play. So this would... Be, kind of exemplify what a bunch would look like you can see here i can take cd lamb in theory if i if i streak cd lamb it's going to be the same thing but as you can see here and, and as you can see it's, it does work really well against cover through cloud but i like the cluster a little bit better and here's why if they flip the play so let's say that let's say you're facing cover three cloud but you're facing the other side of it right you're facing this side right here and what a lot of people like to do is they like to run mabel off of this so something like this right here Right, this is what you're going to get, and then they're just going to lurk over the middle uh, with their with their user. Well, what you can do, first of all, this mesh post is going to allow you to get more routes open. You can run um, some nice route com three man route combinations on the left side of the field. This two man route combination on the on the left side here, though, you've got a Mario Cooper, but then you've also got this route right here. And what you're going to see is he's going to come back to the ball, get wide open against his own coverage. If they flip, if they flip. Um, and actually, you'll see that with this route, typically I can fit this into Schultz uh, over the top of Cloud Flats. So like just pass lead to the left, click on. You see that I can fit that in right there. If they flip the four, if they flip the, uh, if they flip the defense, 
so that you're facing something like this, right? They're going to run the cover through cloud to that side. Number one, you can snap throw the streak to Amari Cooper, but you can also hit this route to Schultz. So we'll show you this here in just a second. But snap of the ball, you can go right in there, click on, and you can hit that inside pass lead po uh, streak. What's not going to be open if they flip it, I do want to show you this real quickly. What's not going to be open if they do flip it is you're not going to be able to all the time get this. It does depend on where the safety, but because the safety starts left, you know, it's going to be, it's going to be a little bit of a tender throw. I don't recommend throwing it. Um, I, I really don't because the safety's now, because they're roll, <laughs> cover through crowd is a roll coverage, right? They're rolling to that play side. In theory, this is going to help the defense out. But what you'll see with Schultz is typically you can hit this route, pass lead that to the left, click on, and you're just going to swerve catch shield him to the sideline that's a pretty consistent dot i mean that's like 30 uh 25 30 yards um no cloud flats gonna get there no no corner um you know this is a way to attack the the defense to the outside this year and then you can also and i threw it way late there but you can also hit the post route when it comes across i was trying to show you some of the route i forgot i have flipped i have to flip the defense so that it flips um but what you'll see here you know same scenario and, and you'll see this is where their user is going to be put in a bind. You got two two middle breaking routes over the middle. I mean, it's a really good play. It's a play that I haven't talked a lot about this year because, quite honestly, I haven't needed it. I haven't needed to go to something like this this year. But um, people are starting to catch up with the cover three cloud and, and weekend league and all that stuff. So you're going to need to use route com. It was like this to absolutely glitch out cover three. I mean, cover three really doesn't stand a chance against this. Um, this specific route combination, in my opinion, just because, you know, they're just going to have so many issues. There's no cover three in the game that's going to be able to guard this. In my opinion, this is probably the best cover three beater in Madden 21, with the exception of one of my favorite ones, which is fade stops, which is in the same playbook, which is ironic. But literally, you can pass lead this click on and typically you can get that over the top of any cover three one of the one other thing i want to touch on before i end the video is i've seen a lot of this right here um i have seen a ton of this right here let me show you what i'm gonna do something like this just right here where they're gonna run the run the corner up the seams i've seen a ton of this and i actually think it's pretty effective but what you'll see here is that deep third on the left is going to completely glitch and you're going to be able to pass lead that to the left, and they're not even going to be close. It's going to be three double buzz, which is a defense that I feel like is pretty pretty serviceable this year. Um, I've seen a lot of people run this. What's also really cool about this, and I don't know about this off the top of my head, so forgive me if this doesn't work. Um, some of you guys like to let me know whenever my play doesn't work. But this is cover two, and this is, this is why I think this is one of the better plays in the game. Because against cover two, you can pretty much get that right over that cloud flat, and you can swerve catch and secure catch it pretty consistently to the wide side of the field and if you have um if you have some type of like drag you want to go ahead and just drag uh lamb across and what you'll see is this drag is gonna it should pull that cloud flat down just enough right there ah throw out a sack it's gonna kill me but you can hit the underneath you know cover two is gonna do okay you're still gonna have the middle post route the other thing you're going to have, and, and, and this is primarily designed to be cover three cloud, but, you know, if they do run cover two on you, which, you know, you can definitely see, I, I can see that happening. Uh, a lot of people are mixing those together. Um, you're going to be able to hit this uh, route to Gallup. If I can throw the ball, you're going to be able to hit that route to Gallup pretty consistently. As long as I don't get, I'm going to go ahead and just block or um, spy some of the guys here. But this is cover two. And, and typically, like I said, out of cover two, they're going to run this this like cover three uh, shell, Tampa two style. But what you're going to see is you're going to be able to hit this post route right there pretty consistently against cover two. So it's a really good zone beater. Cluster, ironically, is really good against last year was really good against man. I think this year you're going to see more people use it against zone. But overall, really, really good formation here in the Arizona playbook. We're going to be updating it into our uh, – we're going to be putting the rest of it into our offensive guide. So if you want to pick up that guide, you can pick it up in the description of this video. But we will see you guys on stream here in about an hour and a half.